Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about radical equations. I'm going to solve each equation, but remember to check for extraneous solutions. So, if I was given this equation, 10 plus the square root of 10m minus 1 equals 13. Okay? Well, we first need to isolate the radical, right, square root. So I'm going to subtract the 10 to both sides. In doing so, I'm left with the square root of 10m minus 1 here equals 13 minus 10, which is 3. From there, I need to get rid of the square root, so I'm going to square both sides, leave me with just what's inside the square root of 10m minus 1 equals 3 squared, which is 9. And I'm going to add a 9, a 1, sorry, to both sides. Leave me with 10m equals 10, right? 9 plus 1 is 10. And I divide by 10, giving me my final answer, which I'll write here is m equals 10 divided by 10, which is 1. Well, we need to check to see if that's a correct answer. So I'm going to do my check over here. Check. So I'm going to rewrite my equation. 10 plus square root of 10m minus 1 equals 13. Then I'm going to plug m, uh, 1 in for m. So I have 10 plus 10 times 1 minus 1 equals 13. Well, I'm going to simplify this. Uh, 10 times 1 is 10. So we have 10 plus square root of 10 minus 1 equals 13. 10 minus 1 is 9. So we have square root of 9 in there. Square root of 9 is 3, and 10 plus 3 is 13. And they're equal, right? On both sides, 13 is equal to 13. Check, and so therefore we can be confident that m equals 1 is our solution. Alright, so let's recap. We started with 10 plus the square root of 10m minus 1 equals 13. I subtract the 10 to both sides, get the radical by itself, then I squared both sides to eliminate the radical or the square root giving us with 10m minus 1 equals 9, right? 3 squared being 9. I added a 1 on both sides, got 10m equals 10. Divided by 10, leave me with m equals 1. I had to check for extraneous solutions, so I rewrote the equation and plug 1 into the equation for the variable m. We then simplified, kept um, all parts of the equation on either side of the equal side. We didn't bring anything over. 10 times 1 is 10, minus 1 is 9, square root of 9 is 3, and then bring the 10 down the whole way, 10 plus 3 is 13. See this 13 come all the way down, not really doing anything. Leaving me with 13 equals 13. That's true, so I'm confident that m equals 1 is my final answer.